Good morning, guys. I'm just coming to you with a quick video because on my way out the door, I looked inside of my bag that I just got from my my recent event um, where I was set up as a vendor. Um, I looked into the my bag that I got as gifts and um, products from the play called the stage play called the First Lady. I ended up getting a sweater. Um, which I thought I wasn't going to be able to fit. So I got it in an extra large and I was really just like, I like this fit though. I like stuff that covers me up and keeps me warm. And I like to dress in layers during this time of the year. But um, I, funny thing, I put on my scarf because I'm like, oh, uh, when I drive, I don't like to drive with my hair down because I'm always like sitting on it or getting it tugged behind me. So I always wear it up. So and I really don't care in which way I wear it up. I just wear it up. But it's cold. It's getting cold. So now my scalp be getting cold because now my scalp is exposed, you know. So I was like, I want to wear my hair up. And I just got out of the shower. But I was like, I need to cover up my head and put my hair up so that I don't get sick. And I'm like, oh, I'll put my scarf on. So I put my scarf on. Originally, I had my hair hanging down so that I don't hit the top of the roof when I'm driving because, you know. It's a big bun. Um, so I put it to the side with the scarf on. But then when I was walking out the door, I looked at my bag and I'm like, oh my gosh, um, her scarf looks the same as mine. So I was like, is this a sign that I need to record? <laughs> so this is me coming with this video. Um, I didn't get to see First Lady the stage play, unfortunately, because I was one of the vendors set up. But I hear that it's a really, really great play. And also I was able to attain, I don't know what this is called. So I don't want to mess it up. But I got a lot of pamphlets, a lot of flyers, a lot of business cards. And okay, so it's Alon Entertainment. I believe that's her um, entertainment name. And then it's First Lady of the Stage Play. I think this is just like a guide. Or um, coming 2024 is called Mrs. Cleanup Woman, written and produced by Alondria McCoy. Coming 2024, this is in the back, but in the front, this is about a stage lady to play. And it says, A powerful true stage play about domestic violence and mental illness happening in the church and community. Um, I won't. read too much of everything because you got to go and check it out yourself. I'm going to go and check it out myself, but I just think that this is a beautiful thing to do that, that she is doing. Playwright, director, and producer. Um, she's done a lot of stuff. This woman has hugged me so tight when she came out and I just felt her energy. I felt like she knew my story or a piece of it. Um, so I just wanted to get grab everything that I could about what she's doing. And I want to go see the next play myself. I really do. This is so nice. Um, and I'm just scrolling through. I'm going to read this. This is the cast um, pamphlet. So... Excuse me. <laughs> okay, so, um,
Whoa, they offer acting classes. Now I might try this out. Always wanted to be an actress. Wow. Wow. So I just learned a few things from reading this myself. Um, I'm definitely going to go catch that play whenever she's, she's um, showing another. Um, I really feel like they should put it on DVD. I don't know if people still watch that or, you know, this new stuff that we're doing nowadays, like streaming it and stuff. But, I mean, DVDs or they just get out there, you know, to work its way up into that if it's not there already. Um, but ugh, I heard it. I heard some of the play. I really wish I was able to watch it so I could give you my opinion, but I know it's good. But I support it. Um, as you guys know, or if you don't know, you now know. I am a survivor of domestic violence, and I just felt so excited to be around um, in a setting and a space where there was people who support those in need or know someone and just giving back to the community and educating the community in so many other ways. Like just the black connection of the black people was really, really dope. Um, and I'm excited for more, for more things, to get into more things and to do more things. So that's all. I don't want to waste too much of anybody's time, but my skin is looking really Rudolph-y in the nose today. I don't know why, but I'm going out. I'm tired. I'll see you guys later.